Hey YouTubers, how you guys doing? It's Tiger here. Um, I'm coming at you today. This is not like a hair video or anything like that. Um, I'm tired. It is now 9.04 p.m. Um, I am up because um, I am cooking some devil eggs, sweet potato pies, and all this stuff for Thanksgiving right now. But right now I'm making devil eggs. Um, for my co-workers at work tomorrow because that's simple and it don't take that long so um, Show you guys what I did here um, Wait a minute my camera is Messing up, okay, but anyway, I boiled some eggs and Those are the ones that are peeled already that are um, in the bowl but I boiled some eggs and then, once the eggs start boiling, as soon as the eggs start boiling, you want to put your fire down low. And that's what I did. Cut my fire down low so it wasn't like no heat except for the heat from after I cut the fire down. And um, then what I did is I took another container. You can take another bowl or whatever you want. And I put ice and water in here and what I did with this ice water is after my eggs were done boiling um, I placed them in this ice water while they're still in the shell and, and what that does is stop them completely um, from cooking from the heat or whatever and you just um, you want to peel your eggs and you want to peel them you know as best you can without puncturing the egg white that's on the outside. You want to try to make it where the egg white still has its integrity so you can um, cut it and we're going to do our devil's egg. And I'm, what I'm doing, I'm cutting those and I'm just trying to peel the rest of these, <laughs> rest of these eggs. I got uh, four more eggs to peel because I really don't want to make one mixture for my devil's eggs and then have to come back and make a mixture just for um, four more eggs y'all so I'm going to try to do this as quickly as possible so you boil your eggs to a boil when they start boiling you cut the fire down on low for one more minute and you cover that pot then you let them sit for about 10 minutes after um, you took them off the heat. Let them sit for about 10 minutes before you put them in the ice water. So my eggs have already did that, except for these last few. Um, well, they sat for like 10 minutes, but these the last ones. One more. <laughs> Okay, and um, okay. This is the basic, you know, this is basic um, devil's eggs. It's really easy. Um, a lot of people like to eat devil's eggs on the holidays, and I find that a lot of people that I work with love devil's eggs. Um, my daughter loves devil's eggs, and yeah, so okay. I'm trying to rush for y'all, so, um, so that was perfect, but yeah. So after you peel the egg, like this, okay. Then what we want to do is we want to cut the egg. So that is so going to need a place to put them after I cut them. So I have my pan here. And I'm going to put the camera on it so you guys can see what I'm doing. And I don't know if y'all can see that. Y'all can see that pan. Okay. Before you try to make a food video, make sure the camera can handle it. But anyway. Okay. So, I'll take one egg. These eggs have already been chilled. And then you're going to slice the egg. Oh, my battery's about to die. You know, slice the egg like that. Slice it in half. So you have two halves. Um, hold on, y'all. Okay. Oh, let me get my charter. I got the charge 
Roger. <laughs> Sorry, y'all. Um, this wasn't like an actual plan video. I just, when I was in here cooking, I was like, let me go ahead and show them how I make my own eggs. So, yeah, that's how that happened. Okay, yeah, so there are my halves. And after you take your half, what you want to do is get a bowl or some kind of container. And you want to dump the yolk out into the bowl. So you just have an empty um, egg um, white like that. Just dump the yolks out and lay the eggs down. So you want to just cut the eggs in half. And that's a perfect half. Then dump the egg yolks in a bowl. And I'm kind of rushing. Cutting it. Okay. I'm putting my egg yolk into the bowl. So my centers are empty, so I can make my filling and put my filling in. Cut in here. I almost messed that one up. I'm not gonna do all of them right now. Um, let me show you guys how I get this started. Okay. Put that aside. You want to cut it the long way of the egg, not across. You want to go cut it vertical. Dump the egg yolk in your bowl. Put your egg halves. Okay. The long way. Oh, I kind of messed that one up, but okay. Dump that to the bowl. All the egg yolk out of there. And this is why I say we, we want to try to not mess up the egg when we're peeling it. That way you have a nice belly to sit that devil's egg yolk in when you're done with your mixture. So all I'm doing right now is emptying my eggs of the um, egg yolk and putting the egg whites on the plate. This is really simple. It's not hard. Mm. Just boiling some eggs. As soon as they start boiling, um, you're going to cut the fire down on low, cover it. And then let them sit for like 10 minutes in that hot water. Cover it. Then after 10 minutes, you're going to put them in the ice water while they're still in the shell. And then you're going to start peeling them. And taking them out the ice water and doing what you see me doing right now. Which is cutting the eggs in half the long way. And Preparing the egg yolks for the rest of the mixture. So, with those last four, I'll do those after this video. I just have to make another mixture. Okay, so now all I did was lay all of my egg whites, um, the empty egg whites, um, on the plate. Okay, so I'm going to get a fork. Now, you're going to take these egg yolks that you dumped out of the eggs and you're going to kind of chop them down with your fork. So we're just going to mash them. And if it's real hard to mash them, you know that you cooked your egg too long. So basically, you just want to boil the eggs to a start boiling, then cut the fire down, cover it up for 10 minutes and then put those 
eggs in some ice water for a minute. Then you're going to start taking them out the ice water, and, um, peeling them, and then cutting them in half the long way, and um, emptying the yolk out into your bowl of choice, which is what I've done. And after you chop the eggs, then we're going to get our ingredients. The ingredients that we need for basic devil's eggs are your choice of mayonnaise, mustard, a little white vinegar, salt, and pepper. So with my mayonnaise, I'm going to take about I'm going to take about a quarter of mayonnaise with a tablespoon and you're going to get like a eyeball shot. There you go, like that. And you're going to put that in the egg mixture. Then you're going to take about a teaspoon of mustard. I got a teaspoon, but that's about a teaspoon of mustard right there. And put that in the mixture with the mayonnaise. A dash of salt or sprinkle. Okay. A little bit of pepper. And then you're going to put your vinegar. Now the vinegar, it helps bring that acidity down. And gives it that little tart flavor. And we just want to put just a little bit of vinegar. And that was probably about a capful worth of vinegar. And then I'm going to mix all of this together. The um, egg yolks with my mayonnaise and mustard and vinegar mix. That's how you do that. And it's getting nice and creamy. And you decide what you want your consistency to be for your devil's eggs, you decide. Some people add a teaspoon or half a teaspoon of um, sugar in their yolk mix because some people like their devil's eggs a little sweet. Um, if I want mine a little sweet, I add just a little bit, maybe like half a teaspoon or a teaspoon of uh, Miracle Whip. Okay. And I think I'm going to add a little milk. I just like mine a little bit, a little bit sweet. So I'm going to add a little milk. About a fork full. Dump that in there. And then I'm going to mix that with my mixture with my egg yolk mixture here and so mine is going to be a little bit more sweet so it's going to be nice and thick and creamy and like this y'all see the consistency of this egg yolk okay and then from there it's very easy now you just want to take this mixture and start placing it in the um, eggs. And you can use, you know, you got smaller spoons or whatever. And just start putting the egg yolk inside the eggs. This is how I do mine. I don't tell nobody how to do theirs. Don't have to be perfect, you know. I like mine have a little rugged look to it. And um uh, I'm just putting um the egg yolk mixture in the center of the eggs that I've cut in half. And don't be afraid to get messy with it because 
It's a little messy if you do the ones which you're supposed to do anyway. So mm, I'm, I might be putting a little too much in my bed, but that's okay. Ain't nobody gonna complain about more mixture than the devil's eggs. And I'm just putting this all in my egg halves. And that's basically it. That's a basic devil's egg. Basic devil's egg. And, oh, I'm so tired, y'all. They better appreciate this. I gotta go in and work too. Okay. Cooking for my job. Cooking for me and my daughter. Thank God, everybody else grown and gone. But they live in Illinois, and I'm sure they would. They wish I was up there so I can cook for them. Cause I got four boys, but they men now. One of them is Muslim. You know he can't eat no pork. He's not gonna eat no pork. So, yeah, my mixture is almost gone. And I have some more eggs, so I'll have more mixture. And I don't know what to fill. One. Let's see if we can fill up the last of these three eggs. Two. I'm scraping now. Scraping. I got um, what I smoked paprika and you just sprinkle that on top of the egg. Um, however much you want to sprinkle. It's up to you. Mm. There you go. Those are my double digs. All right, you guys. This was my first food uh, tutorial. And um, this is the finished product of my double eggs. You probably can see them better in this light. And it was really easy to make. And I'll be back with another recipe when I get in the mood. All right, you guys. Bye.